Sri Lanka's unresolved conflict has inevitably taken its toll on the Sinhala Tamil and Muslim relations throughout the years. But there are still people all over the country who continue to live in mixed communities despite the challenges. The fishermen of Nigambo is one such group. Situated in the western coast, Nigambo is amongst the more larger and popular fishing hamlets in the country. Bound together by trade for centuries, the fishing community in Nigambo number around 5,000 persons. Belonging to several ethnic groups has imposed a problem for these people. In fact, they pride themselves in the close fellowship they've enjoyed as a community for centuries. <laughs> A unique feature about the folk in Nigambo is that a majority of them are monolingual. The grasp they have of the Sinhala and Tamil vernacular makes it tough to point them out as a Sinhalese, a Tamil or a Muslim. People in this fishing hamlet all share a common identity. The bonds forged through their profession are sturdy and unshakable and leaves no room for squabbles to break out over their ethnicity or religion. It seems that their only problem is being unable to freely engage in their vocation due to certain restrictions. It is clear that fisher folk in Nigambo and those in several parts of the country have been impacted by the security situation in the country. Having stuck together, through for better and for worse, they are hopeful that the situation will begin to improve in the near future. The unity of fisher folk in Sri Lanka demonstrate as a community in general and the fellowship in Nigambo in particular no doubt serve as valuable examples of coexistence in Sri Lanka.